Ray Drew, Mustang on the left side out of Hales Corners. Currently qualified in the number six spot, also a former division champion. And speaking of champions, here comes the champ for Hussey, Hussey Copper. Hussey Performance, Talonair, Red Line Oil. Tony Bartone owns it. Steve Boggs from Ohio tunes it. Sean Bellamere drives it. They got the number one on the side for a reason. That's Steve Boggs out in front. He was up moments ago. I talked about he was up here watching the Gordon car. Well, because fast guys watch fast guys. It's really as simple as that. Apparently, they're pushing one around the top end up there. I can't see over the Sunoco vision, but we're holding up here for just a second. I mean, the good news is the alcohol cars don't build heat or burn fuel nearly as quickly as the nitro cars do, but there still comes a time, you know? It's not like they got radiators in them. And it looks like we just got word from the top end of the racetrack. So the starter go over and whisper to both crew chiefs, hey, here's the deal. It's going to be a second. And they both nodded, said, yeah, okay, I'm good. And Steve Boggs just told his driver, go. Sean Bellamere, second-generation driver, the Killer Bees. Trying to work his way up out of the number 10 qualifying spot. Both of them move a little to the left, but both of them get through there. 5.542. Tuck him one foul behind DJ and one hunt in front of door in front of Doug. Ray goes 557, 261 miles an hour. Ray is now in the number seven spot. Sean is now in the number four spot. Ulf Leander still sitting in the number one spot, but check this out. Behind Ulf at 550, Matt Gill at 552, who has not run yet. And then DJ Cox, 54, Sean Bellamere, 54, Doug Gordon, 55, Bob McCosh, 57, Ray Drew, 57, and Annie Wiley, not run yet, 59. The entire top half of the field is jammed in there. Six cars within five hundredths of a second. The whole top half within a tenth. 